And with this, we are coming to the end. So you have attended the Photogrammetry 2 course from the beginning now to the end, and you have learned a lot of approaches and things that you can do when you deal with multiple images. So you learned how to estimate the relative orientation of a camera pair or an image pair, for example, stemming from a stereo camera, things like the eight-point algorithm. Uh, you have also seen what you can do with epipolar geometry, um, how we can estimate solutions in a direct fashion and in an iterative fashion. Um, this then has led us to the bundle adjustment problem where we try to estimate the location of our cameras as well as the location of 3D points in the environment jointly in a least squares fashion. We looked into questions such as triangulation, estimating the absolute orientation, um, using the 3D model that we have generated from the bundle adjustment system, um, exploiting uh, this 3D information in order to compute orthophotos, so um, images you kind of can measure in. And then we looked into online approaches, introduced the base filter, which has led us then to the simultaneous localization mapping problem. So that when you have attended this course and uh, studied the material till the end, you should have a pretty good idea how you can perform 3D reconstruction based on camera images, and how you can estimate where a camera is in the environment based on corresponding points, and how you can do that in an offline fashion, but also how you can do that online so that you estimate the quantities while you're processing the data or while you're actually recording the data from your sensors. So with this, you should have a very good foundation for several um, image processing problems for um, especially 3D geometry estimation and I hope that will be useful for you in your subsequent studies. Thank you very much for your attention and for attending this course.